What's up, guys? We're Sight After Dark out of Brooklyn, New York, your new favorite band. I'm C for Graffiti. I'm Dan Berg. Check out our music. Shaking up the faces and moving all the pieces. You can't get what you want, no matter if you need it. A spirit exercising, somebody's prophesying. And check us out, reacting to Sweet Dreams by Roy Buchanan. Back on the channel for Roy. Shout out to our Patreon and our patrons who made a poll and suggested this one for us. And guys, you can be like them and head on over to Patreon and subscribe. Get in on all of our content and our content decisions. And don't forget to thumbs up if you like it. What the fuck? <laughs> why? Why do that? Why? Know. Why not just end it? Like, That's it. Just I just want you to know. know. <laughs> this is the end. There's nothing more after this. Okay. This is why the fuck. There's a, still another minute of this in the video. That's hilarious. But all right. Well, let's go back to something 
Yo, that was funny. The shady cameraman. Like, she could not believe it. <laughs> she could the... not believe she was seeing this shit. She was just like, she was like, no. Is he? There's no way. But how could? How is this? Why? Mm-hmm. But, but he. Mm-hmm. But I don't understand. Yeah. <laughs> She's literally mesmerized. Yeah, the Look at shot this. of him with the kind of light off the side while they're just showing his face playing it. It kind of looks like he's up in the stars and he plays up there. Like, and we're all down right there. This one. Like, yeah. yeah. It's just like there's just this, this being yeah. that plays up by the moon. <laughs> yeah. You know. Shout out to the underrated legend. Roy Buchanan. I think, honestly, like, obviously he's amazing at guitar, mm-hmm. but the thing that I think stands out the most to me watching this and in the other videos that we've done from him is, like, his demeanor. Mm-hmm. Because it's almost like he doesn't even give a fuck. Mm-hmm. Like, he's so stoic. Mm-hmm. And, like, you would not know any of what he's feeling by his, his physical expression, by his face. Mm-hmm. He lets the guitar do all of the work. Oh, yeah. Like, there's no question about what he's feeling because of what he's playing. Yes. But, like, it has nothing to do with anything else. Mm-hmm. Like, other guitars, they go, ah, you do all these faces, they're, like, mm-hmm. like, 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 almost like they're crying when they hit, like, a bend, you know mm-hmm. what I mean? Shit mm-hmm. like that. He's just, mm-hmm. this is what matters. Yeah. You know? I wonder what his guitar's name is. I, I may have asked this before, but if you know uh, Roy's guitar's name, I would love to know the name. That guitar sang, it cried, it mm-hmm. weeped, it moaned. Oh my gosh. Like, I, I don't think we'll get stuff like this ever again. You know, like all these old guys from back back then that just, I don't know. It's just, it's just so, it's the patience and mm-hmm. the timing with the notes. That's what it is. Like, the flair was all in there, but it wasn't crazy special speed bag type of flair it was right. just so gorgeous there was nothing that he was doing just to do it right but he was doing whatever he wanted to do but there still happened to be that flair in it mm-hmm. you know i mm-hmm. think that's the distinction because you can do things to be showboaty mm-hmm. but then it's not going to have that same feel to it because mm-hmm. you know you're just doing it to do that you're not doing it to serve a song right but everything that he was doing was serving the song mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it was crazy I, I was thinking, like, what what could you possibly sing to this? You don't even have to. Like, the guitar literally sounded like it was singing in the middle. Mm-hmm. Like, wow. Shout out to the that Telecaster tone. Mm-hmm. Only a Telecaster could sound like that. It's true. I have a cheap one, so, you know, my <laughs> so you're an is great. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm an exception. <laughs> but it looks like that. It does look like that. <laughs> um, but no, something about the, the Telecaster, I think it's because of the, 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 the way the pickups are. It just cuts through. Mm-hmm. In a way that not really any other guitars do. And yeah, the tone was great. Everything about this was just so good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I wish that they showed his hands a little bit more. I sometimes get frustrated with the um, 70s concert videos. You know, they kind of show the artist and not like the actual fingers and hands sometimes. Yeah. Um, I, I really wanted to lean forward and really stare in this. I would look just like that girl. Yeah, I would look just like her. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, especially like, you know, with him, it's like, it's all, it's all in the fingers. Mm -hmm, So, mm -hmm. but whatever. I mean, I'm glad that we, you know, have this footage to look back at. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I can always look at, look back at it and really increase it and, and stare at it (laughs) on my own time. Yeah. So shout out to Roy, the legend. Shout out to everyone on Patreon that voted for this. Shout out to everyone watching on YouTube. We appreciate you. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We're Side After Dark. We'll see you soon.